Hey guys, welcome to At Home, hanging out with Rosanna Pensino. Hey. We are working here on the dining room, the entry, and this little space under the stairs. I just need to ask you, how vain are you? I <laughs> you have three giant mirrors. This looks a little, I don't know if I can say culty. I mean, I don't know what, but it's like, we just threw them here. They were extra mirrors from our old house. You can check yourself once, and then twice. Final check. And then final check. This is actually really nice. Yeah, I, I love I, that. I like this, this here. And oh, I mean, okay. the whole thing is, what do you need when you come in your front door? You need somewhere to throw down your keys or yeah. a couple of things. So you should have some sort of a console. You need some rugs on your floors. Yes. I see, like, even in the dining area, you don't have any rugs down. I love the backdrop here. So, I mean, that, that wine wall is really beautiful. It's missing one key component. Mm -hmm. wine. wine. So do you have big family get-togethers where you have big formal dinners. formal dinners with family? Yeah, for like the holidays, we'll all get together. So this would probably be the space where we try to do that. But on the daily, yeah. it's kind of this like workspace that's away from the desk. Have you tried to do any work to the house? Oh yeah, you're looking at it. This table right here was an old table that I decided I'm gonna re-sand and finish it. it almost looks like you tried to paint it and then stain layers. it and then like rub it off. Drew, uh, the professional I am, I did this in 110 degree weather. Things were drying way too fast because of the heat and this table got messed up. <laughs> Two things about the table. <laughs> One, okay. it's too small for this space. It's yeah. such a big room. I think you could have a bigger table. Mm -hmm. Two, not gonna hire you as our stain expert. Mm -hmm. Three, mm -hmm. A for effort though. I'd also love to point out these chairs. You will find these all over my house. Uh -huh. They're in this room. They're in the office. <laughs> They're in my mom's room upstairs. They're in my glam room. I use one in my office. Mike's got one <laughs> okay. in his office. I would look under the stairs. I've never had stairs that were exposed like this. And my last home underneath the stairs was like built in. Seasonally, I'd probably put my Christmas tree yeah. here. Yeah. Other than that, I mean, I literally, you can just run around here <laughs> in well, circles. Well, you can. And, we can. And live. Yeah. <laughs> well, <hold on. laughs> Tag your it. Wait, there. It's, there it's easy for all of us. Right now, this is just um, a lounge area for your dog. Your dog bed <laughs> matches your dining chairs. Oh, no. <laughs> Everything in this house matches. Artwork up here. Yeah. Ooh, art. Yeah. Yeah, there's no art in the house. What is your design aesthetic? What do you like? I've always liked a farmhouse and Mike likes modern. When we found this house, it felt perfect because it combined both. Mm -hmm. I like the details, like in the wood, that it's not yeah. just a white wall. I don't mind modern as long as it feels warm. And I do think a lot of the wood makes it feel that way, but yeah. I would yeah. like it a little warmer. I love the cleanness of modern, Yeah. but I just don't want it to feel cold. And for furniture, I like stuff that looks good, but it's it's also very functional. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ro and Mike have let us take the reins. They're willing just to have us come in and do what we do best. So we've been sourcing a whole bunch of, we have great local artists. Pete Halverson is an amazing photographer out of LA here. A friend of ours, Dennis, uh, he's a photographer with Leica and we were out at their headquarters in Germany, in Germany and we met Pete who's just from so 15 minutes away from here. Anyway, so he's got amazing art that we're gonna find a few pieces to put into the design as well. I love under the stairs spaces. Now, what do you think for under there? Do you wanna do like a seating area? I think some sort of a nook. Oh, that's gonna be good. Lots mm -hmm. to think about. You ready for your road trip? Are you ready for our road trip? Oh, I'm ready. This is uh, my Just beach clothes. Me hanging. Oh, is that a high five? <laughs> Did I, you see I, you hold my hand all funny? I thought you were trying to like hold my face because you like lined it up perfectly to right there. Oh yeah. It's gonna be great. Today we're actually going to meet an artist. Pete Halverson is his name. We're gonna meet him and see what kind of artwork that he has for Rose House. For Rose Place. There are a lot of great walls ready to be adorned with amazing local art. Yeah, and I love to, a lot of his photography is just of California and there is a real vibe and a feeling that his artwork evokes. And I think that's something that Ro and Mike would really love. Yeah. This is what I love. It's really important for the design. It's important for the yes. design that we have to go and spend the day at the beach after we chat with Pete. Field so, trip. Yeah, so it's just to get in the, in the spirit of the design. Yeah.
thunk that a bowl of lemons would be like a hundred pounds. When life gives oh. us lemons, we you place work them out? on a dining table for row. This table is gorgeous. I love the the, the soft tone of the chairs yeah. up against that dark live edge wood. This whole dining room transformation is just amazing because before it was really just like a conference table feel. Now it actually feels like a home where you could be proud to entertain family and friends. Or still have meetings here. The showcase over here, you know, just having a little bit of wine. Just a just little bit Just putting a little bit of wine, wine in there just for a, a nice backdrop is great. The table itself is a piece of art. Look at the legs. I love the style of these chairs as well too. I mean, it's a beautiful compliment to the dark wood tones, but it almost hugs you when you're in yeah. here, when you're sitting. I love, I'm just gonna sit in all the chairs. You I love it that out. it's modern, but because of the fabric, it's still, oh, this is and it comes with massage. I don't remember what I was saying. <laughs> they're structured, but they're, but they're soft still and comfortable. they're very like cozy yeah. chic. The biggest thing for this space, the dining room, is that we wanted to feel like a dining room in a home and not just a conference room. And I think bringing in some of the warm tones, that French country that Ro really loves, that's what really makes it feel like mm -hmm. home. And I love that the rug kind of ties everything together, like the blue gray of the ceiling and the wine rack. Like it's just like, it's cool and cozy. The rug is anchoring the space yeah. and now it actually feels like something that fits with the rest of the home. Mm, dinner parties. This is one of the pieces from our friend Pete Halverson. So we've actually used some of his pieces throughout the house because it really does give that California vibe that is perfect for this home. Ro and Mike are not allowed to see until we say they can see. This is the office we just showed them. And now we're dining room. We're should, ready. should I stop talking? We're ready. <laughs> wow. Wow, we have a carpet. We have a, <laughs> you a have table. You have a grown up dining room. We have a, a table that you wow. have. Look Look at at these these chairs. Chairs. So. Oh my gosh. What do you think? This is amazing. You already had the, the built ins, but it was empty. And you had a table here, but you didn't have an area rug or anything else. So, what's the biggest change for you? I think you combined my love of the modern with Rose preferences as well. So that is magic. I don't know how you manage that. That makes me so happy to hear because that's the hardest thing, like making everyone who lives here happy. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I can live in a beautiful French little cottage. Like I love all those beautiful details yeah. and I feel like the lights do that, the candles do that. The Somehow chairs. this yeah. works together where it feels like a blend of us. I mean, this table is absolutely gorgeous. Oh and the gosh. way that the chair is just complement that What's this color. called? Drew, what is is this that's, when it's like that's a live edge? Oh my gosh, this makes me want to have a party right now. And I'm, I finally was able to see around Drew, he's very tall. Yeah, and we have an entire cart over here. Oh, I love it, Mike. Look at us. We have a bar cart. You have a little bar cart? Anything this else? This is so nice. And, and this is what I need to do when we're in here focus. Not <laughs> only have a good time, but we also use this room for meeting room, so focus. I need to focus. Yeah, focus. When, you, when you're pouring <laughs> your martinis, show us your bar cart. Yeah, what was that again? <laughs> We don't we have literally any have a family member come over and they're like, this home aliens live here because there's no oh. art, there's no pictures, nothing. So to actually Now we have um, proof we're not aliens. There's art. <gasps> a bar cart. We and have art. curtains! We yes. have curtains! <laughs> so before we started, we labeled this house as the house with no curtains. Mm -hmm. In fact, your neighbors told you and they had told us. Can you please get them curtains? So we wanted yes. to do something. In this area here, you know, the dining table, the light fixture, this is really the focal point. We wanted something mm -hmm. soft on the walls, like these panels. These are Scott Living by Smith & Noble panels. And nice and tall, so it draws your eye up. You have great detail already in your ceiling. It yeah. looks yeah. like grander with, with something that goes all the way up to the ceiling. Yeah, and actually I'm gonna just tell you guys, that's a little designer tip for you. Even though the windows don't go all the way up, you can elongate your room and make huh. it feel more impressive by taking your panels all the way up. That's a good tip, because yeah. it really does look taller in here. As soon as you walk in the front door, we just want everything to feel like home and have that vibe. The dining room now feels like a dining room. That little empty nook under the stairs, it now has Not purpose. Not empty anymore. There's more art. It's yeah. Pete's. Yeah, Pete's pieces are all throughout. Pete's everywhere. And then your front foyer here is just so grand, but still like humble, and we reused the beautiful mirror that you had already. Also, mm -hmm. that chunky piece of wood that you already had, we moved that down here because it makes more sense here. It's so, so beautiful here. It feels finished. And you guys found a use for that huge pot I ordered. Yeah. I thought I had ordered this little <laughs> vase online. And it was humongous. It was like rose. But it makes so much sense here because this entry is so nice and wide and tall. 
Yeah. And also it gave us a chance to put a nice big yeah. tree in there. I know you love greenery, okay. same over here yeah. in the corners. I just love that we have more like plants and trees in the house because there was just a lot of white walls. Yeah, yeah. like aliens. You know, yes. For people, we have plants and trees in art now. This is actually the massage room as well. Oh, oh. yeah. Great. Yeah, Mike, that's oh. perfect. Just a little higher. Oh, yeah, we're rolling, rolling. Oh, oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, this has been a lot of fun uh, showing this dining space, but there are so mm -hmm. many more spaces. So be sure to check out the other videos and like if you like it. Yes, mm -hmm. subscribe to their channel at home and ring the bell to receive notifications so that you guys don't miss any of the videos coming out. Let mm -hmm. me tell you, the glam room, your bedroom, there are a lot of fun Guess things room. coming up. I can't wait, because in my glam room, I just had a folding table. Back to the massage. Oh, yes. Okay, yes, 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 yes. I'm just falling asleep <laughs> right now. This is pretty nice. Okay, there's more house to get to. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Bye. But